guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing my 2024 temperature blackout day. So yeah, let's go. Okay, so before we actually get into this video, um, I want to say that I'm starting a post, a post schedule. So, um, three days a week, so on Monday, which is today, and I'm filming the video that's supposed to go on Monday, and I'm filming the video that is needing to be uploaded today. So on Monday, a temperature blank update. On Tuesday, not Tuesday, Monday, temperature blank update. Thursday, a, um, a vlog. So, like, I'll start it Monday and end it Wednesday, and then upload it Thursday, um, and then... Like, I'll film a little bit, uh, from, uh, Monday through Wednesday. I'll, like, film a little bit of those days. And then upload it Thursday. Saturday, I will post absolutely anything. Um, so, yeah. So, now we can get into the temperature blanket. So, first, if you don't know what a temperature blanket is, a temperature blanket is a blanket that you either crochet or knit. So, you have to choose one and do one for the whole project. Um. So, I crochet, so that's what I choose. You crochet one row for every, the, for every day of the year, and you choose the color based off of the temperature. Sorry, I feel like I have to burp, because I just, like, drink milk. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's crazy. Alright, um, so you have one color for every nine temperatures. So, yeah, so like 0 to 9, 10 to 19, 20 to 29, 30 to 39, 40 49, and she goes all the way up to like 99 to 99, or you can do above 100. I don't know if I'm doing that or not. I haven't bought that color yet because I haven't, it hasn't really gone above 100, but anyways. So, yeah, I have my temperature colors here, and I will show you them. So, this one is 90 to 99. I haven't used this one yet, and I am using the highs, so... And then designed it now, which is really like peach, not peach, uh, pink, not really light, but it's literally on the color, it's the thing, it's just called pink. So, yeah. Um, and then for 80s color, this color, it's called light peach. The 90s and the 80s I just bought because, um, I was, got behind, like, a lot. And then one time I had where it was the 25th and the 26th of February was 80s here. That was in the 80s, and I didn't have that color. So when we bought them, I didn't buy the very low color, uh, 0 to 9, um, or the two high ones, the 80 to 89 or 90 to 99, um, because, um, you know, like the 99 and 89, it wouldn't get up to that for a while, and then, um, the very low, whenever I was using the highs, I wouldn't get up to that, like, at all, um, so, yeah, and then this is the 70 color, which is, like, a probably one of my favorite ones, this one, and the light peach color for the 80s, that's my favorite one, um, it's called Buttercup, this is the 60s, 50s, Forties, which is like almost white, but it has like a tint of blue. It's you can see it better in like the whole skein of yarn. Um, Thirty to thirty-nine, twenty to twenty-nine, ten to nineteen, and I do have a border color between every month. So like once a month is done, I do one row of white to like uh, separate them. So yeah, and then. It's just white. So yeah, I will show you my blanket. Um, it's pretty long. It's it fits about my bed. My bed is a full size bed, so it's not um, it it's not a twin size bed or a queen size bed. It's like right in between. So these stitches are done. I haven't done today's, and I won't be able to do today's because I have to get this video up. So yeah, I will show you it. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, I'm going to show you it close up so I can, like, you know. Okay. Let's clear this piece. Alright. Here it is. 
it's on my bed right now. Alrighty, so this white line down is all of January. So that's all of January. Um, let's see. This white line right here down is all of, down to this white line is all of February. And then above the white line is all of March that I've done. Not very much. <laughs> but yeah, it's about like a lap. Like a lap. It'll fit across my lap. So, um, like when I'm working on it, it'll keep my lap warm. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> but yeah. It's going to be really big. And I'll probably be able to use it like a regular blanket. Like where it just like for me to work on it. So like the waist down. Probably. Um. Uh, June, May, or June, or July, May, June, or July, so yeah, that's what I did, alrighty, okay, so, um, like I said, I haven't done today's, and I won't be able to do today's in this video, I will probably do it tonight, um, I don't even know what the high is today, but, um, so, yeah, because I have to get this video up, but I will tell you guys one thing, um, but the, at the beginning of February, I wanted to do item, uh, uh, gosh, I feel like I'm losing my breath because I just, like, ate, so I'm like, uh, I just drank milk, so, yeah, um, at the beginning of February, I wanted to do a temperature blanket update for January, so at the beginning of, of February, so I could like show January, so I didn't do any February, so I can just show you guys January, but, um, I kind of forgot, and I was like pushing it off for some reason, I just like completely forgot about it, and um, I was so behind, so like I didn't do the rows um, at all, and then I think... <laughs> I don't even know because the thing is with me when I behind on my temperature blanket, I dread working on it because I'm behind. Um, and so I would be like starting this project and be like, Oh, I don't really want to start that project because I have to catch up my temperature blanket, but I don't want to cut do it because I hate doing it when I'm behind. But one time I got behind so much, it was like probably over twenty days. And I was just like, you know, I really need to catch up doing this. And it took me a little bit. But, yeah, one day, I think, it was because we were in the camper. And so, like, we were stuck in the camper. So, I didn't really have anything to do. So, I just, like, literally, for me, I just brought the yarns, my blanket, the yarns to do it, and my hug. That's, like, one hook. And just the yarns to do it and just my blanket. So, yeah. So, I could just work on it and not do any other projects. So, yeah, um, that's all I have. I'll show you guys it. But yeah, about March 8th, I got officially called up. And today is March 11th, which is um, my little brother Shepard's birthday today. <laughs> but yeah, we didn't really like, do anything. We did make a cake. My mom did. So, yeah. That is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give this video a big thumbs up. And like, subscribe, and share. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!